Well, and if you can't fix it with tie wraps, then don't even bother. Connect it two tie wraps to each other. There we go. And now I can easily get the elastic through. Perfect. Okay, final result. I think that looks pretty damn good. So not a chance, water can get in like this. We can see the hatches are broken. So there's water coming in uh, and all these seals doesn't uh, seal too much. So instead of, spending, instead of spending now $200 on new windows, that looks beautiful, check that out. And uh, saves a lot of money. So when we save up and I have a, lot, a little bit of money, I can change the hatches, but for now, $18 for all the material and uh, that's it a little bit of uh, elbow grease Okay, a little bit of shitty weather today. So uh, yeah, I've done all the sewing today So you can see we have nice blue screens. There we go. Gives a pretty good light actually It's just like water. So you can see it was leaking over here, but with the new covers It should be all good now and yep, it's really bad weather outside So it's not only sunshine and happiness here Check that out. Yep, it's in the rain. He's getting the boat all cleaned up, you know, the big red line. So it's all gonna be white and shiny again. But happily, it might be raining, but it's still like 25 degrees. Pretty busy in the anchorage. And now we have a floating bar next to us. Big cruise ship over there. And we've got a little fisherman. Don't know what he's diving for, I think lobster. Okay, so time for lunch. Made some pasta pesto, there we go. And then... A pretty big swell coming out of Bocas del Toro. We're gonna go to Puerto Colón. That is where they're gonna check out the boat. Uh, and if the boat is uh, considered safe to go to the Panama Canal, we're gonna go through the Panama Canal just before Christmas. So uh, there we go, off. Well, there's some big, probably can't see it that good, but okay, maybe you can. So there's some pretty big waves coming in. Uh, hopefully the swell is in the back. 30 hours to Colón from here. I reckon we do it in 24 if everything goes right. So, uh, Cologne, here we come. Sales are gonna go up. Whoa. Nobody's on the ocean but us. Check that out. Doing easy six knots. Seals are out on the way to uh, Panama Canal. This is the life, people. Cup of coffee, autopilot on, coconuts in the background. We've got some nice wind going on. We've got the main sail out. We've got the channel out. We're doing on the sails. What is it? Around about six knots. 6'2", 6'3", so we're gonna be early uh, at the Panama Canal, finally sailing again. I can miss this, so relaxing, away from civilization, no people around me, just me, the boat. And uh, Yip is having a little power nap, and my turn in a little bit. Okay, time for a power nap for me. Well, you can see we're rocking really from side to side. So if you lay like this, I'm gonna be rolling like this all the time. So the best trick is, ah, go sideways on your boat like that. And then your feet can be locked in there, your shoulders in here. So uh, this way I'm not rocking as much as you can see my clothes are rocking. So, for me, this is the most stable position. 
Nighty night. Another day of Big and Yip around the world. Well, first we thought the engine was overheating because there was a lot of smoke. So we raised the sails. Well, that's the rope that's supposed to raise the main sail. So we can't raise the main sail. And then uh, Yip discovered that uh, the exhaust broke off. So we can also not start the engine. So we only have the Genoa. We barely have any wind. So uh, let's see if we can fix uh, the engine. Oh my God, that is bad. That is really bad. That's completely broken off. That's gonna be a hard fix to do right now. Only thing I can do is get that whole block out. That sucks. I know you don't want to be filmed on a scale of 1 to 10. How shit is this? That's pretty shitty. This, <laughs> this how happy are you if it's fixed? Uh, 10. 10. <laughs> okay, so we're floating around. There's no wind, there's no sails. <sighs> Can't really get much worse than this. Okay, so happily I sort of got it fixed. Um, I loosened it up here, so you can see it was up till there. Uh, pulled it down. You can see I shoved it in here tied it up with tie wraps of course it's not 100% sealed but here I've got an extra vent to get the gases out there's another vent up here blowing now that's getting the gases out so if I seal everything up the gases are gonna be blown out let's start it see how, how bad it leaks Okay, just woke up from uh, my power nap. There's a ton of water in the, the boat. And in the bilge, the bilge is on. Yip is pumping outside. So, or this came from uh, the exhaust. And Yip didn't do the checkup enough of there's a hole in the boat. Because there's a whole lot of water. So yes, things can get worse. What the hell is that? Good morning. Daylight again after a horrible night. Oh, I'm so tired. Hopefully, uh, I can see a little bit again. Doing three and a half knots of wind. Just on the Genoa. Oh, that's a beautiful start of the day. Things should not get anywhere here than this. There is a little flying fish in my toilet. A little bastard fell through the window. What the... Okay, decided to get the engine running because otherwise we will not make it before dark and we want to be in before dark. So we cannot be in here because I think you can see it. Because uh, the water lock broke, that means there's exhausts coming into the boat now. Got all the hatches open, so it's ventilating well, but uh, you don't want to be inside. So that means that we're going to arrive around 4 or 5 o'clock and then 
think getting into the marina and then fix everything tomorrow. Water is calming down a bit. At least we have sunshine. Genoa is doing its work. Land inside. Okay, buddy. We thought nothing could get worse. What does that look like? Like it's not working. That looks like an exploded bilge. Okay, so we have two options. We connect our other bilge here, or we're we gonna pump manually. What do you feel like? Pump, man pump manually. Okay, if you wanna do some dim. Oh good, one bilge out, let's empty the Yes, land inside. Worst case scenario, we can swim from here. So many boats. All these lights are boats waiting to anchor are waiting to go through the Panama Canal, they're all anchored. Okay, so we're pretty close now to Colón, so to the Panama Canal uh, entrance. We have to call then on channel 12 to the Crystal Ball uh, signal station. There's a lot of chatter here on the canal, uh, on the channel, just listen to that. Okay, that's what we need to do as well, calling in that we're coming through. I hope that there's not too many big ships coming out and uh, that's gonna be a calm entrance. Well, this is pretty funny to listen to. Somebody of a container ship dropped his anchor a little bit too close and he just went like, yeah, sorry, we already dropped our anchor. I request you to pick up your anchor and move further away, okay? This is not safe, you are within my swinging circle. Station calling, you can proceed to Shelter Bay. Thank you. 